Yes, the Chiefs' first preseason game was over the weekend against the Seahawks. Fans were out here early at Arrowhead tailgating, but with one change. The smell of barbecue fills the air. The sea of red covers the parking lot hours before kickoff. And the tomahawk chop is heard throughout the city. That's just another game day in Chiefs' kingdom. But a new rule may be changing that. When I first got to the stadium, you know, we saw a parade of golf carts out there. And that's when I kind of knew there may be an issue with this new policy. Uh, they, it seemed like they hired a lot more people to kind of enforce this policy. That new policy? Yellow lines in the parking lots to encourage tailgaters to keep the lanes clear. But for some, it makes tailgating a little uncomfortable. And I took the picture of the three kids uh, next to their tailgate, and they were very similarly one foot out of their yellow line. A uh, person came over and was like, hey, we need, you guys, we need you guys to scoot up a little bit to make sure you're within uh, the other line. That's new policy. And because of that, that put their faces like right up against the tailgate. Bob Fesco chimed in this morning on his radio show, calling it an unfortunate situation for fans. You're messing with tailgating in Kansas City. That's not something you want to mess with. I mean, raise the price of parking, fine, if you feel like you have to do that. But don't tell people where they can tailgate, where they can't tailgate, and how they can tailgate, because tailgating is a part of who we are in Kansas City. Bob, always shooting it straight for us. This is a new concept, so with anything new, there's going to be some growing pains with fans, the Chiefs, and their security team. I reached out to the Chiefs. They will have a statement later today. We'll have that for you coming up at 5. Reporting live in Kansas City, Rachel Sanchi, KBC 9 News.